but I'm not an expert. I could never start or scale my online business. You know, this is something that I bump into so often. Um, you know, when it comes when people are, are, are not, whether even experienced online business owners or people starting up, that they feel they need to be a true expert in the field. Um, and bottom line, I don't agree with that. Um, and not alone do I think you can start or scale your online business, but I believe that you and we, we have a responsibility to do so. You, you see, I believe that it's the online entrepreneurs, the knowledge business owners, that can actually have the greatest impact in the world. But far too often I see people sitting back and complaining about government or big corporations that they're not doing enough to improve society or give back to the community. Well, I honestly believe that's the easy way out. And I think it's shifting responsibility away you know, from us, away from the people who can have the biggest impact in the world. You know, and I've been blessed to work with thousands of small business owners, and I've seen the impact firsthand that small businesses, and in particular, online businesses and knowledge-based businesses that they can have in their online communities. But not just there, because then it goes further. When you're a successful business owner, when you've scaled your business, now you can start giving back to your community and indeed to other communities in the world who really, really need it. Well, if you like, this is my call to you to, to step up and to be counted um, and to take responsibility, not for making the world a better place, but for making your corner of the world a better place. You know, like never before, the world is looking for leaders. You know, uncertainty, uncertainty abounds in so many areas. And what I've witnessed, you know, in my own clients and as well as, you know, my fellow online entrepreneurs, you know, to see people from in the parenting space, in sales, coaching, historical dressmaking, currency trading, to knitting, to see them all stepping up and stepping into their power as leaders and to provide comfort, hope and inspiration to their community, you know, in a deeply personal way that large corporations and governments never really could. You know, whether you're beginning your journey in the online knowledge business world, or if you're an established on online entrepreneur, this is exactly what I help people to do. You see, no matter what your niche or your topic, I believe that a real opportunity exists for online business owners to create this safe space to help like-minded people connect and feel a sense of belonging around a specific topic. And this really is one of the three main drivers why, you know, no matter what the topic you teach or whether you have an online course or a membership, that people will join. That's the community. And along with accountability and enhanced opportunity, we'll talk about the other two in later videos, that's really what is going to help people move forward. And this is why I believe that, you know, you don't have to be this subject matter expert. Um, but there are some kind of ground rules, just three things that I think here are really important. You know, first of all, well, I, I help impact focus, you know, scrappy underdogs build long-term sustainable online businesses. Now, if you're looking at this video, I kind of already know that you're not somebody who woke up this morning and, you know, came up with a get rich quick scheme. I know that you have a level of expertise and knowledge to share with the world and really, this is underlying it all. I kind of, you know, there's there's so many people out there who just say, hey, just start a business and just pick a topic and go with it. That's not exactly what I am saying. But here's the thing. You don't need to be the subject matter expert. You only need to be a subject matter expert. And in truth, you only need to be a couple of steps further down along the road than your audience. You know, and yes, you have to match your marketing and your claims about the level of transformation you can achieve to your level of expertise. But don't necessarily worry about that right now. There's plenty of room for everybody. And I've never come across anybody who didn't have an area that they could pick and, you know, and demonstrate an area of expertise and fashion an offer that would ultimately convert. So I do believe that everybody can start an online business. Um, and it is literally a matter of picking out where you can best help them. So that's kind of the first one. The second one is, 
I think you have to be committed to lifelong learning. You know, I honestly believe as, as long as you have some level of life experience, we can come up with a topic in a business model that will get you started in the online world. But here's what I also know. If you want to build a long-term sustainable business, you have to be committed to a life of curiosity and learning. You know, nothing stands still. And what got you here will not get you there. And if you're coming on this journey, you have to be willing to grow as a person and, 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 and as an online business owner. And you know, this is one thing that I see, especially with people who've had a level of early success. They can get so wrapped up in the business and so wrapped up in you know, what they did that first time that they forget that they need to move their own level of knowledge on over time. And moving towards, you know, when like a, most of the big names, the big gurus out there, they didn't start out as the go-to expert in the air in, in, in their topic. But over time, they grew into it. And you need to be have that path in place for you. So that's the second one. Then the third one um, is the technical expertise is only a fraction of what will be required to make it as an online business owner. You know, you have to be willing to grow your understanding of psychology. And that's both from a marketing and business development perspective but also from a delivery perspective as you know, especially in the, in the areas of fulfillment, when you're delivering your course or your membership. And the other big thing is you have to have an understanding, I think of coaching, you know, there's famous saying out there, if more information was the answer, we'd all be enlightened billionaires with perfect abs, but it's not what you need to become an expert at is how to get people results. Results are all that matter. And what you need to do is take your expertise and your knowledge and figure out what are the next step of people who might only be a couple of steps behind you. What do they need to take in order to get to where you are today? You know, and this is the exact reason I believe that sometimes it, it can be a negative to be the subject matter expert, because when you've gone that deep in a subject, you can forget the challenges that people have when they're starting off. You can forget the challenges that people have along the way. And you get so, you know, kind of immersed in the subject that the, the little the, the little inconsequential things as they appear to you are actually huge boulders and, and, and massive mountains that need to be climbed for others. So no matter where you are right now, whether you're looking to start your online business or take it to the next level, remember that it isn't a matter of if, it's a matter of when, you know, no matter who you are or what niche you're in, I could show you people with less knowledge, less skills, less ambition, who, you know, had less in life, who started after you and they've made it in the online world. For me, the most important thing to move past the, but I'm not an expert feeling is to get out of your own head and think about those that you can help today. Those that need you right now and those who will continue to struggle unless you get your message into the world and provide them with the support that they need to move to their next level, whatever that is for them. So look at wherever you are looking at this today, like, subscribe, share with your friends, make sure to scroll down, leave a comment. You know, I personally respond to every comments made on any videos, no matter where it is.